I started skateboarding when I was growing up. It's something that allowed me to play in the city and to explore the urban environment in a very different way. I always consider it to be one of my first experiences of a performance practice. Skateboarding is particularly important for girls in the West Bank of Palestine because it's been introduced to them in a very inclusive way. So girls and boys see skateboarding as something that both girls and boys can do. When they are skateboarding, they're learning to trust their bodies, to be confident, to kind of problem solve and develop their physical and creative skills, and they can use those beyond skateboarding and beyond playing. Due to restrictions placed on Palestinian people, they find it very difficult to leave the West Bank. And they're not, for example, able to travel easily to the sea, which is not very far away at all. Skate parks quite often reference the sea in their design, which comes from the history of skateboarding and its relationship to Californian surfing communities. So for a lot of Palestinians in particular, the skate park functions like a simulation of sea waves and the experience of children using the skate park flowing through those concrete waves gives them the same kind of feeling of freedom and joyfulness that they get from being at the sea. 